everybody, this is Nora with NAQ57 and what you are looking at is this huge stamping plate LC18 that after I cleaned up for the first time after having used it, it has become just like a mirror. <laughs> yes, you can see everything and which is why I am holding it at an angle here otherwise you will see nothing but the reflection of my camera and my lamp and that's my wall clock right there <laughs> so the reason I am holding this up here guys is because okay so this I have there's a little bit a little bit of a story here this is one of my very original stamping plates I have no idea do not remember where I got this it was somewhere online when I started nail art a few years ago about five years ago and I loved it because it is full of a lot of cartoon images that we are familiar with or yeah those around my age range because well there are some classic cartoons here like the Flintstones Tweety Bird and then there's some more recent ones like Spongebob and then there's some Disney characters well there's the classic Betty Boob that I love um, Pluto and look at that Smurfette um, Jasmine that's who I was trying to think of and yes so there are some newer um, characters here as well but I pulled this out because very recently I saw a video by Melinda Conley and I will have her vi her video linked down below so you guys can check her out she is the sweetest heart very talented with her acrylic designs so very recently she purchased she um, the same plate and she was surprised to see how that plates can actually come in this size <laughs> yeah and when I saw it I thought it was the funniest thing because I said oh I had that plate I love using it and I thought it gave us a good reason to come up with a collab so that's what this video is going to be I am doing a collab with Melinda and we add so the making of this video we just said let's just kind of wing it you know picked a few of our, our favorite characters. I do not know what her design is going to be. I am sure it's going to be fabulous and beautiful. So for my design, what I decided to do, I am going to do Fred Flintstone and Wilma Flintstone. There are these two images right here. I am going to do a reverse stamping and I'm going to color them in and I'm also oh another thing that I'm looking forward to is one of the reasons why I had not used this plate more often was because these images are huge i mean check out check out let's see can you see let me um bugs bunny there compared to my index nail it's huge but as if you guys have been following me for a while you know that i've discovered somewhat of a an awesome way for me to shrink my images and get them on my nails so that is what i'm going to do today i also have uh, a somewhat of a new way to use that same stamper for shrinking so you'll see what I mean about that okay so that is the intro for this video guys let me go ahead and start with the tutorial and I hope you guys enjoy nice going driver just in time for the flight to Texarot come on Wilma step on it Rubbles isn't it exciting Pebbles you're going to visit Uncle Tex on his ranch <gasps> Uncle Tess. <laughs> Uncle Tess. Oh, he'll love her. Maybe enough to give her a few shares of oil stock. Oh, uh, yeah, Fred. Uh, there's nothing like a rich uncle. Uh, maybe if I'm real sweet, Uncle Tex will adopt me. <laughs> <laughs> now, stop it, Barney. Just be thankful we were invited along with Fred and Wilma. Look at that, Bam Bam. He won't make a move without his barbell. Oh, okay, Bam Bam. Th that's enough. Drop it. Yeah, right on my toe! See how he listens to me? <laughs> Hoppy, we almost forgot about him. Ow, 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 ow. But where is Dino? Dino? Dino, where are you? <laughs> okay, we're all here. I still don't see how we all got in that little taxi. Well, it uh, just shows you the power of positive shrinking. <laughs> Fred, shouldn't we be checking in? We'll miss the plane. Oh, don't worry, Wilma. I know this airline. They never leave on time. Last call for Texera. Flight number seven leaving on time. Smart Alex. Hey, that's us. Well, what are we standing around for? Come on, Betty. We better take Dino and Hoppy to the air freight counter. Poor things. They'll have to be locked up in cages all the way to Texera. <laughs> 
<laughs> Hurry up, Barney. Follow me. Right, Fred. Flintstones and Rubbles to Texas Rock. You're just in time, gentlemen. Good. <laughs> we wouldn't want to keep my rich Uncle Tex waiting. <laughs> Now, let's see. You're flying on our special one-class midweek economy blue ribbon 30-day tourist excursion family thrift plan, correct? Uh, no, well, we're going by plane. Oh, cut it out, Barney. If it wasn't for the family thrift plan, we couldn't afford the trip. Now, I'll have to weigh your baggage. Uh, here you go. Hey, it's genuine aeroplane luggage uh, made out of an old aeroplane. <laughs> <laughs> Thirty-nine and a half pounds. For this, I had to go to college. <laughs> Just under the limit, Mr. Rubble. Your bag, Mr. Flintstone. I'll do it myself. One hundred pounds? Uh-oh. Fred, you're overweight. <laughs> Really, sir, we sold you the family thrift plan, not the family cheapskate plan. So uh, this is what they call the family thrift plan, huh, Fred? Yeah, except the ads don't tell you that the head of the family rides on the outside. Oh, well, uh, you know these coach flights, you uh, do away with the frills. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Fred, look at that big black cloud up ahead. Yeah, what about it? Oh, looks scary. Oh, don't be so ignorant. That is just typical of the cumulonimbus simbus formation found in these warmer climates. Well, 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 what were you saying about the, 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 the warmer climates, Fred? I, 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 I guess we, we must be taking the, uh, the, the polar route. <laughs> Okay guys, so here is the final result after I applied my Sage top coat. What do you guys think? I think it turned out super cute. I love the Flintstones and by the way, I am going to tell you if you are here watching this and you grew up watching the Flintstones, let me know by a high five down below or a punch fist. Yes, <laughs> check them out. I love, love the Flintstones. Wilma and Fred, oh my gosh, what a lovely couple. So here they are. So as far as some hints, when I was doing the stamping, if you notice, I was I picked up the image with the clear stamper and then I went on my other stamper where I did the shrinking and the reason for that was because I wanted the mirror image of these these images. I wanted the how the reverse of how they were on the plate because of the nails, which nails I was going to place them. And um, on top of that, I needed them a little smaller, even though it made it a little more difficult to paint inside, but no problem. And yeah, this finger and this one, I just used some all water decals that I had. Oh, and the other thing that you saw me do, do so you know when you do your stickers, you have that extra excess of uh, some polish around the image? And I, let me tell you the truth, this was the first time I've done it, and I did it with Wilma, and it worked out so good, Then so i show you how it worked out with Fred. I sprayed alcohol on it, so yeah, I just sprayed some alcohol, you know, alcohol evaporates almost instantly, but it was enough moisture to attach and get rid of those uh, creases and bubbles, so how about that? Okay, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video, remember to visit Melinda's YouTube channel. I will have the link down below and give her some love, show her some love and give her some thumbs up. So I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial and this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more, and thank you for watching.